everybody it's profane hurricane back here again with more dying light and last time we left off we had uh, turned on the gas and uh, our boy Jeff was inside and our boy Jeff is uh, no more so he exploded <clears throat> Because he didn't explain how to turn on the gas properly. Nope. All right. So now we're doing a different side quest. We're just trying to get our side quests under control because Are you Tolga and Fatine? Thank you. Yes. How did you <clears throat> surmise that? Who cares how his ape brain processes information? We have a job for him. Quite right, Tolga. Remember, simple words only. Don't confuse him. These we need to guys. move some equipment across town. It's very heavy. How heavy? <laughs> Too heavy for you, Simeon Beast. Instead, we will propel it across the sky using heavy gauge zip lines. A brilliant idea, don't you think? That was my idea. No, it wasn't. Just tell me what you need. <sighs> well, hooks, obviously. How else can we hang the equipment off the lines? Oh, he's You'll guys. find them at the train yard warehouses. Does he know what a warehouse is? Probably not. Look it up, but be quick about it. This project is far more important than anything your proto-human cranial cogitator is capable of understanding. Why and are you guys such dicks? don't try to figure out what it is. Oh, heavens no! You'd give yourself an aneurysm. Okay. Well. Ah, we have employed a...
Oh, there's a ladder. Oh. Let's loot all the stuff. I wish I had uh, more ammo. That gun is amazing. But I don't.
can I jump on that? Yeah, okay. Uh, so now... your hooks. Ha, incredible! We have underestimated him. Well, we can hardly be blamed for that. Look at him. Are we done? You're done. We have work to do. And when we're finished, we'll leave some zip lines up for you. Yes, we know how you primates like to swing from the vines. Oh, I hope you guys die. I hope you guys die a lot. Um... Hey, you been looking for a runner? Well, we're looking for one who will say yes instead of no. Jafar can fill you in. Okay. Hey, you want to try calming down long enough to tell me what's wrong? Yeah, sure. Oh, That's twitchy and weird. Calming down will work. Yeah, calming down will solve everything. Huh. No, walking away from you will solve everything. Yes. Okay, okay, hang on. What the hell happened to your hands? I'm chill, bro. So, I make these flares for a rise, right? Wait, flares? Like, like signal flares? No, no, UV flares. Like flares that the night things can't stand because they put out this UV, which stands for ultraviolet, which is like kind of a science thing. I got it, UV flares, continue. Hey, crack it. There is no continue. My zinc is contaminated with fluorine. It's useless. Also, I'm out of turpentine, which isn't that hard to find. Except everything's hard to find right now. So when Rice's people come for their merchandise... Oh, is he using people now? I thought he only used hired psychopathic gorillas. What do you need to make these things? Just zinc and turpentine, bro. I got the rest. Worst part is everything I need is in the train yard warehouses. But a guy like me isn't going to last 10 seconds out there. Well, I'm surprised a guy like you's lasted that long in here. Oh. Oh, the, oh that's very funny. Ha ha. Very funny, funny man. Maybe I'll get your supplies, but if I do, whatever you can make out of them, I take half. Half? No way. You're freaking nuts, bro. Look, you can give me half of something or you can keep 100% of nothing. Half it is. It seems fair. Dude, I was just at the train yard thing. Shit, it's you again? I mean, what are you doing here? Relax, relax. I don't work for Rice. That was a one-time job and it was all about protecting the tower. Look, I'm sorry. I mean it. Is that right? Look, everything I was doing, I was doing for Brecken. You can ask anyone in the tower if you don't believe me. So what do you got, Jafar? We've been picking up some of Rice's transmissions. One of his crews found something at the construction site, and they got very excited. They didn't say what it was, but they referred to bringing down the entire tower in one shot. Someone's got is to find out what it ball? is, and either confiscate it or destroy it. Well, I'm someone. Congratulations. The job is yours. We'll be in touch.
there. Yeah, it's data. So. Crane? You're Crane, right? Kyle Crane? Yeah. Erwin Snowberg, movie director. I make these zombie annihilation movie series. Yeah, you've probably seen them. Uh, no. Yeah, they're thought-provoking meditations about people very much like yourself who have to kill buttloads of zombies for various reasons. The details really aren't important. What is important is production cost. Makeup is a major factor. I'm talking head rot, arms falling off, guts hanging out. And when you blow them apart with guns, those squibs cost like crazy. So you've come to Haran? It's a tragedy, of course, but there's a fortune in special effects shambling through the streets just waiting to have their heads blown off for my next movie, Zombie Annihilation 4, Dying Lunch. <laughs> wow. All I need is a gun nut who can drop in spectacular numbers, and I am told you are just such a man. I mean, are you, are you gonna give me, are you gonna give me something, or? What do we got? Steal from a thief. Firebug. That's hard. Oh, man. What do I have to do? Sneak close to a boulder during the night and get a tissue soon. Alright. I guess I have to do it.
where the uh, where the guy was. I went that way, right? Did I go that way? Maybe because I killed it, that it would give me the. It would give me the credit for it. But I don't know where it was. Reset because it wasn't giving me the there it is. Okay, your chunk of zombie guts. because I really don't want to fucking travel the entire city at night just to give you your, your shit. That is no fun. Uh, 
Crane, come in, come in. Did you get the samples I asked for? Excellent, excellent. I was just telling Dr. Camden about you. Hello, Mr. Crane. Glad to have you working with us. You uh, sound like an impressive individual. Interesting stuff what passes for blood in this creature. Photosensitive. Quite deadly if used on a weapon, I'd wager. But I digress. My last bit of reagent here, and a reserve vial of... Oh, my word. This tissue, it's testing positive for the recombined virus. Camden, do you know what this means? The no. Experiment worked. When I dose the meat samples with the altered strain, it's had an effect. This could explain all the different mutations. So you caused this? I can't. Camden could. He has the equipment. But we have no way to get the research to him. So you can talk to him on the radio. Why not share the info that way? There's too much data, Crane. It would take years. We'd both be dead and gone before he finished. Water, water everywhere. And not a drop to drink. What if I delivered this stuff to you, Dr. Camden? By hand. The data and the tissue samples both. Getting from here to there would be insane. Yeah, but it dangerous. could mean a cure, right? You don't know how much this means, dear boy. To me, to all of us. I'll contact you when everything's ready. You must go now. Much to do. Much I don't know why do. the audio cuts out on the stuff, I guess, in the cutscenes, because I guess when you're turned away from people, it's, uh... Doesn't work right. Omar and I went to blow up that nest. Wait, you what? Fucking hell, Raheem, that was my job. Oh, right, because you're more qualified to handle explosives than I am. You're just a goddamn tourist. Listen, we messed up. Messed up bad. All right, what happened? Where are you? We're on the overpass, and it's all going to shit. Listen, head to the train yard. Find a place to hide. I'm on my way. Behind you! Raheem! Raheem! God damn it. Reckon. Oh, no. Reckon, do you copy? Yeah, I copy. What is it? I'm on my way to get Raheem. Raheem? He's here in the tower. No, he's not. He and Omar went to blow that nest, and now they're in trouble. Like, what? Fuck! Who'd they what? Where'd they get the explosives? Well, I... Look, I stole them from Rise. Oh, Jesus, I just trust. I'm close. I'll get him to safety, Brecken. You damn well better. You save him, you hear me? You save him so I can kick his fucking ass. Does Jake know about this? No, she doesn't. For God's sake, don't tell her. She'll go out looking for him. And I don't need her getting herself killed too. God damn it! All right, so we got to save some idiots from some bullshit, but we're going to do that next time. Uh, thank you very much for watching, everybody. I will see you next time. Take care. Bye-bye.